What appears to be a new truck, but appearances can be deceptive. Volvo Trucks vehicles are part of a life cycle in which material from end-of-life trucks is used in new vehicles. What's more, the environmental benefits are impressive. As much as one-third of the total weight of a new Volvo truck is accounted for by recycled material. The Volvo Truck Centre in Kunjalv in Sweden is one of the workshops at which old trucks are dismantled for recycling. This Volvo FH from 2002 has covered a million kilometres and its service life is over. When scrappers Jimmy Gustafsson and Kenneth Olsen have finished their work, 90% of all the material will have been utilised. While the truck is still at the assembly plant, its fate when it stops operating is already taken into account. Material with good recycling characteristics is used and the components are fitted in such a way that subsequent dismantling is facilitated. This is something for which the staff at the workshop are grateful. They follow a dismantling manual that Volvo produced back in the 1990s. All the environmentally hazardous liquids are removed from the truck. The vehicle is then stripped methodically. Anything that can be sold on the used parts market is carefully labelled to enable tracing. In this case, the cab is in good condition and will be washed and sold. The engine is too worn and will be melted down. The metal will then be used for new engines. All the material that is removed and cannot be sold is sorted individually. Iron, aluminium, brass, copper, plastic and so on. It is all either recycled or used for district heating. Nothing is dumped at landfills. The same thing happens to many new trucks, but this is nothing to be sorry about. Manufacturing products from recycled material requires less energy. In the Volvo trucks life cycle, the carbon emissions for each recycled truck are reduced by more than four tonnes.